People keep saying Trump's tweets and outlandish statements are a distraction. But a distraction from what? While attention has been focused on stories like Obama wiretapping, visits to Mar-a-Lago, and Ivanka Trump's clothes being dropped by Nordstrom, over 2,000 new bills have been introduced to Congress. Here are eight of the most significant. H.R. 861. This bill is just one sentence long. The Environmental Protection Agency shall terminate on December 31st, 2018. So what's going to happen to all its regulations established since 1970? Who knows? H.R. 610. Worried about the defunding of public schools? Critics of this bill certainly are. It will change how federal tax dollars are distributed among private, public, and home schools. H.R. 899. This one will get rid of the Department of Education by the end of 2018. Education Secretary Betsy DeVos stated that she would be fine with having herself worked out of a job. Again, no answers for what will happen with the department's grants, budgets, or its staff. HJR 69. There are U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service regulations that say you can't kill certain wildlife for sport rather than for necessity. This bill aims to get rid of those regulations. H.R. 354. This would prevent any federal funds from going to Planned Parenthood or any of its affiliates for one year, unless they prove no funds will go towards providing abortions. That's except in cases of rape, incest, or life-threatening conditions. But using federal funds for abortion is already prohibited by law. It's called the Hyde Amendment. H.R. 785. H.R. 785 weakens the power of labor unions by prohibiting them and employers from requiring workers to join unions to get or keep jobs. Critics say the bill would lead to lower wages and greater unemployment nationwide. H.R. 83. Cities like San Francisco, L.A., and New York City have openly said they wouldn't abide by some of President Trump's deportation policies. This bill will punish all sanctuary cities by stripping all federal funding for at least one year. H.R. 147. Last but not least, H.R. 147 would impose criminal penalties on anyone who performs abortions for a variety of reasons. Violations or attempted violations could result in fines and or imprisonment up to five years. It's a felony charge. These eight bills are just the tip of the iceberg. All American citizens, whether they're for Trump or against him, should be aware of what's going on in their own country.